stomach bloating may cause the belly to look puffy, swollen or even hard. A person may feel like they need to pass wind or go to the toilet more often than usual. Often, it can be related to eating certain foods, being under stressful times or occasionally it could signal cancer. One of the main symptoms of bowel cancer can include stomach pain or constipation. This will often cause the stomach to bloat and therefore is a major symptom to spot. If bloating is a regular occurrence for you, it may be difficult to know whether you should be worried or not. Your stools will hold many clues to your risk, however. Omicron variant symptoms, the telltale sign that comes out at night, doctors update bloody stools there are several possible causes of bleeding from your bottom or blood in your bowel movements. Bright red blood may come from swollen blood vessels, hemorrhoids or piles, in your back passage. It may also be caused by bowel cancer. Dark red or black blood may come from your bowel or stomach. Tell your doctor about any bleeding so they can find out what is causing it. Omicron variant, the scratchy symptom to spot, inside Omicron variant, most important symptoms to be aware of, tips Parkinson's disease, how many times do you poo a day? Advice, other signs of bowel cancer can include, abdominal pain back pain difficulty sitting comfortably and moving around loss of appetite indigestion constipation needing to pass urine often breathlessness tiredness and weakness. There are certainly many risk factors that can increase a person's likelihood of developing bowel cancer. This includes being overweight, not exercising regularly, and eating too much red and processed meat. The best way to minimize your risk of cancer is to eliminate risk factors that you have control over, such as lifestyle choices. A bloated stomach is not a pleasant feeling, said the Cleveland Clinic. The health site added, while it's a common experience and usually temporary, you may become weary of the cycle. Spending a little focused attention on the problem to identify the cause can be well worthwhile. Try recording your symptoms and possible triggers in a journal. Note diet, hormonal and stress factors. When in doubt bring your notes to a specialist for professional guidance, 